Hello there, Kyle Katarn here, coming back for another reaction to Star Wars Resistance. This is episode 13. It's called The Doza Dilemma. Presumably something to do with Captain Doza. I guess we'll see. This is a highlight reaction, meaning that it's been trimmed down to 10 minutes of fair use footage. If you want to check out my full-length reaction to this episode, head over to patreon.com slash channel. You can check it out over there. Alrighty, let's do it! Man, they look so good. Clearly, you're not as ambitious as we thought, Kragen. I have lost more men and These ships fucking pirates. than this deal is worth, Pyre. I want triple the money. Then you will take something precious from Captain Doza. And what would that be? His daughter. Something that is very close to him. Mm-hmm. The Doza Dilemma. Tora Doza. All makes sense now. You haven't reported in, Sonara. Spending too much time with your friends. I hope she defects. I, I really like Sonara. I would have already. What do you want? Tonight I am sending Valak and Drell. They will be shipped to the Colossus in a container. Make sure you are the one who receives. Bet that container it smells really bad. Security. We get paid, and you finally get to come home. All right. Looks like Sonara has a moment of truth here. I don't think she's gonna help them. I think she's gonna sell out the pirates and join the Colossus proper, because it's Disney. Good game, Tora, but not good enough. That's another thing that Resistance has given us that we haven't really seen in other Star Wars media is video games. Like, we've seen the ones in Tora's room. they got the holographic dartboard. We've seen the Dejeric tables on uh, the Falcon, and that's about it. Outside of Resistance, I mean. We could try out the new Drone Blaster game I just got. It's so wizard. Let's go back to the tower. Are you sure I can come? <laughs> of course you can come. Yeah, I feel kind of guilty about it, don't you, Sonar? Tora, the 1% up in here. The nice ass digs compared to everybody else. That's cool, those are literally the training remotes from A New Hope, just holographic. Your turn, Sam. Sure. She got the little Ewok toy back there. I love it. So behind. Speeder. And that poster says. All new. That wasn't on the screen long enough. Pretty good for a salvager. Where'd you learn to shoot so well? Oh, you know, looting and killing and pillaging and stuff. As a child. That's cool. New nitro dust. I love reading the Orabesh on the posters. Nice. You couldn't hit the broadside of a space freighter. <laughs> God, Cass sucks so much. I should go. I am. Um... I gotta go do some treason. See you guys in a second. If you wanna hang out, just use my security code to get in. Tor is way too trusting. First of all, uh, I'm talking business, Tora. I like the Captain Doza's security droids are clearly related to the model of droids we saw in that New Republic prison ship in episode. I think it was six of uh, the Mandalorian. Like they're not the exact same droids, but they're clearly like a different mark of the same answer, like Captain. series. You have been delaying the inevitable for far too long now. You need troops to protect your station, not racers. I'll need more time. Don't be stupid, Doza. I hope that he's double-crossing the First Order and he's kind of just like playing them for fools. But I don't know. He could be that dumb. Was that a picture of Bucket or a picture of Chopper that was on the inside of that locker panel when the droid came out? I'll have to go back and look at it after the episode. Let's get some food. Yeah, Bucket doesn't have head, doesn't have arms. That was totally Chopper. That was a cool Easter egg. You get no I like the character food. designs of these yeah. pirates. Someone's tiling us. He's a weak way. I'm not sure what she is. Ow, ow. Uh, baby, watch where you roll, will ya? I am pretty over the slapstick in this show. It's like, I know it's for kids, but it's like, come on, guys, I get it. You can tone it down a bit. What are you after anyway? His little girl. Called it. Tora. Break out the droid, Papa. Oh, shit, haven't seen those things since the Clone Wars. Cool, nice throwback. 
hurry before they discover these four are down. <laughs> this is me during quarantine right here. She is worth triple the credits if we bring her to the First Order alive. Why? Why didn't you tell me? Because he doesn't Cause trust you. you. Are getting soft, Sonara. Exactly. You see these people as your friends. Oh, got to stop this. Captain. Sounds like she's made her choice. Security droids have just been deactivated on level eight. Send a squad of security droids. At least he's quick to act about it. Yes, sir. Bora. Get to your ships. Fuck yeah. I love all the ship uh, action. The vehicles really do look great. That skip is pretty cool too. You can bet my father Damn, this guy's got so many rank placards on him. He's probably like a higher rank than Grand Admiral Thrawn. I know that's not how they work. Don't blow me up. <laughs> she hears the exploding ship and she just knows it is his crappy thing like straight away. The fireball. And back up. There we go. Man, the fireball sucks so much. That's a cool shot though. Mission is a success, Commander Pyre. There's nobody on those speeders. That's pretty smart of the pirates, actually. I do like the design of the skiff. It's, it reminds me of the skiffs from Jabba's sail barge. But like a, like a beefier version. I know you never trusted her. I get it. I get it. Dope. What is that? That's fucking badass. Oh, look, it has the front part of an ATST, an ATAT on there. That's awesome. The wings of a lambda on the bottom. Bunch of sails. Know, that I thing is badass. Can't let them take Tora. That thing is so cool. This can't get any worse. And worse. Oh shit, that's way worse. Okay, Fucking first order's first. arriving. Commander Pyre sends his regards. Saw that coming. Oh, sh oh, I thought he shot Kragen for a second there. No! The Trandoshan pirate! He was my favorite! What the fuck is going on? Yes? What is it? Your daughter is safe. Okay. Aces, break off the attack. It was some false flag bullshit. I get it now. To try and buy the allegiance. It's pretty clever. It's not what it seems, dude. They didn't hurt you, did they? Commander Pyle was very concerned to hear that security was compromised and your daughter taken. Mm -hmm. He has offered to leave you a small security detail at your disposal while you consider our agreement. Oh, jeez. You never know what can happen at any given time. Is that a threat? I'd like to see my daughter in Totally a threat. It's a slippery slope, man, leaving troopers on there. That seems to be another thing that separates the First Order from the Empire, is the the tactics employed. They seem to play a lot of head games and do a lot of psychological warfare. Versus just straight ground and pound, base Take Delta it. Zero. The First Order has betrayed us. Hey, Sonora! Thanks for helping out with Tora. No thanks to me, but she's safe. Good. No thanks to you, no thanks to her. Anything happened to her. Mm -hmm. Hey, by the way... Yeah, it was uh, a late night shipment. I'll see you soon, Sonara. Be well, Kaz. The trust is shattered. Or at least it's shaken. I know BB-8. She's either helping the pirates, or she's one of them. Why not both? A crisis of conscience. All right, well that was a good one. Um, I liked it better than last week's. I like action involving the pirates and Sonara. She's a cool, she's a cool character, and I'm glad that they're fleshing her out more than just like random side character pirate. And I hope that she does turn turn a new leaf, I suppose, and join the Colossus because she's cool.
That pirate ship was dope. I really liked the design of it, the way it uses actual sails. Cause it makes sense if you think about it for stealth because they probably want to minimize their engine signature. And so instead they just have sails going by. That's pretty smart from the pirates. And I love that it's like hobbled together from different ships. There was the front section of like an at, -AT walker on there on the top and on the bottom. You can see the long wings from a Lambda shuttle. Very cool. Yeah, this was a lot of fun. Looking forward to the next episode. My reaction for the next episode will be posted next week. But if you don't want to wait that long, you can go over to patreon.com slash channel and check it out right now. You can also check out the full-length version. Thanks for watching, everybody. Check out the rest of the channel for more content, reactions, and reviews. Leave me a comment if you have a question or something to say. If you want to support the channel, patreon.com slash channel. You can become a member over there. You'll get access to all kinds of cool stuff like early access, full-length reactions, content polls, exclusive videos, and more. Thanks again. And as always, may the Force be with you.